Nancy Drew. I'm your Gibbs. Let's get into this. I don't think we have much for inventory wise. Uh, let's see here. We have Zeke's something or other here. We have our assignment piece, and it looks like we've got two eyeballs. So, uh, and we just talked to the Hello lady again. here. Nice talking to you. Come see me anytime. Yeah, she seems a little, hmm, almost put out by, I'm going to say, the son. Who might be selling off stuff or something. But I don't know, we'll, we'll kind of have to figure out what the motive is here. Why can I not touch this? Why was I able to zoom in here? I want this bone shovel. Okay, let's go back out here to the cemetery. Ooh, what's this? Oh my goodness! What the hell? What the heck is this? Ah, don't bite me! Alright, so here we are. We're gonna be go ahead and uh, clicking on our... Ouch! Ow! Mosquitoes and what have you. These things are evil. How do we keep them down? That should keep you guys quiet for a while. There you go. Ooh, peach. One low quat's all I need right now. Okay. Why do I need one right now? Is that, in my mind, is a good question. Okay, so what else do we have here? We can go to the left. I like the sound of the rain. It's kind of a peaceful rain, don't you think? Can't seem to get at that, that mushroom. Uh, what else do we have out here? What the heck is this? Hello, secret wall or something? Ah, uh, that's it. Weird. Okay, so I don't know what to do with that wall yet. We'll have to come back to that at some point. Weird bugs are weird. What about this gate? Ooh, I can go forward still. Hello? Oh, is this a maze? I think this is a maze. Oh, Nancy Drew game with a maze! Big shocker! Oh boy. I probably should be writing this down. What the heck is this? Crowning Crips? Let's go that way. Sure, we'll go that way. What is this place? Uh, gotta do fishing here? It's a weird mushroom. And we have a boat here. Alright, I guess we should turn around then. Oh, I figures I'm going to have to do the maze, aren't I? A maze to get back? Slumber gardens? Terra siesta? I can't even go forward there. Big broken down tree here. Oh, what's this? Door rattles. I don't really have a key for this, so we'll have to come back to that. Uh, anything else interesting? Sorrow Park. I think this is the exit, isn't it? What the heck is this? It's just a view. Wow. That is a huge graveyard. Charles a wicker. What is this? West, north. What is this? That's a code for something. I'll take a screenshot of that. I wonder if I'll ever be able to get back home. <laughs> I'm completely lost. Go this way. Oh, that's the way I came. Okay, open the gate. Oh, what's over here? Huh. 
Oh, it took... What did we take? I have no idea. Whatever that is, we took it. Actually, it just reminded me, I, sh I gotta make some phone calls. I haven't talked to anybody since I started the game, and that's also a big part of the fun. So... I think what we'll do... Oh, what's this? Shiny object. What is going on here? Just randomly climbing things? Huh. What the heck's it doing? Oh! Feather? What are the chances of being left, right, left, right? I'm gonna say... oh! Let's see what this does. It looks like these are all just feathers. Four feathers. So how do I get the other feathers? That's the question. Huh. Okay, well we'll come back to that. I uh, really want to get out of the rain. Back to the house, I think. Phew. Now we're out of the rain. Uh, I think he's in here. We're going to go to the other room. Over here. Oh, I see. Okay, so I can grab this and move it around. Okay, thank you for that pointing that out to me. I know that there was a comment in the last video that said you can move around the cemetery. It is kind of neat that they have a miniature of it, that's for sure. Oh, what's this? Ah, pretty colors. Is that supposed to be the Arc de Triomphe or something? Music for the ears. I'm not sure if I want to be buried in slumber gardens. <laughs> okay, let's move out of here. What else can we do? Crowning Crips. 40 Winks, Monolith. Monolith. What? Oh, hello! Now we have three eyes! Why do I need all these eyes? I don't know. No, stop grabbing that, please. I want to back out. There we go. Yeah, we did this one already. It's musical. Well, colorful, musical, whatever you want to call it. It's both. I want to use my, uh, <laughs> my middle wheel mouse and zoom out. Like it's a Google map or something. Oh, that's a creepy tree. That was the maze I was just in, too. Huh. Oh wow, what the heck is this? It's a random bone. How do I get it? Where am I? Ah. Withering Roots Memorial. Maybe we have to go there at some point. Okay, let's back out of here. What I would like to do is... Uh, See what kind of phone calls we Oh, let's call Bess. Hello? Bess, hi, it's me. Hey, Nance. I just got back from shopping, which I am happy to report is fantastic here. So, what's going on with you? A lot. A lot is in a whole bunch of fun stuff? Let me start <laughs> by telling you what happened when I arrived at Henry's house. I walked up to the front door and discovered it was open. So I walked in. Wait, what? What happened? You were knocked out by a skeleton wearing a red ascot? Someone dressed as a skeleton wearing a red ascot. Although the housekeeper here thinks it really was a skeleton, Mr. Death. But then she's a little strange. You think it was a burglar? I'm not sure. I caught him or her sneaking around this scale model of a cemetery. 
so if I just knew why they were so interested in it, I might be able to figure out who Skeleton Man is. I know that tone of voice. You're not leaving there until you've done just that, are you? Oh, I also found some kind of receipt in the fireplace that may or may not be a clue. What's it a receipt for? That's what I need to find out. See, it's half burned up. All I can read is the receipt number and the name of the place it's from. Zeke's. Zeke's? You gotta be kidding me. Why? What do you mean? I mean, I'm sitting here on our balcony in the French Quarter looking down at a place across the street called Zeke's. That's great! So go over there and ask whoever's behind the counter what receipt number 21-3872 is for. Uh, okay. You... you want me to snoop? I wouldn't call it snooping. Uh-uh, forget it. Not gonna do it. Beth. I'm not good at that sneaking around stuff, Nancy. I get nervous, my tongue gets all <laughs> knotted up, my palms sweat to say nothing of my armpits. Beth, receipt number 21-3872. <laughs> Just go in and ask what it's for. No big deal. Maybe not for you. Beth, you can do it. Mm, this is not gonna end well. I just know it. Okay, I'll call you as soon as it's over. I'll be waiting. Wait, wait. Are we gonna be Bess? I think we're Bess. Ah, oh, that's cool. Okay, I'm gonna save the game here. Just because it feels like a good spot in case I make a Bess mistake. We're gonna go over to Zeke's. Granny Pumpkin's Cajun Cooking. There you go. Mmm, hot and spicy. Yeah, we'll have some of that. Ooh, that was hot. <laughs> okay, what are we doing here? Can I talk to the dude? Why am I like all hunched over? Eat up. Oh, I get to pick them all. Ah. That mm. was yummy. Okay, let's go through the list here. Uh, Granny Seafood Gumbo. Of gumbo, please. Dive in. Spice that up there. That looks delicious. I don't think I've ever actually eaten gumbo. Woo! That was hot. Yeah, spicy hot. So jambalaya. I have Enjoy. definitely not had jambalaya. In fact, uh, I I have had crawfish. Go. These are the only things I've had. The other two I have never had. I would like to try them though. Oh look, I'm all red. <laughs> I just burped fire. <laughs> okay, okay, that was too fun. So that's the food truck. Let's go over here then. Zeke's. What in the world is this place? Ah, uh, that's creepy. What is this? Uh, hello? Mystical toast? <laughs> uh, that's kind of bizarre. Hello? Hey, doing a little end of the day shopping, huh? See something you like? I like everything. That's what I want to hear. <laughs> I'm Lamont. This is my place. So if you got any questions, I'm the guy to ask. Actually, I do have a question. Um, this friend of mine found the number of a receipt that came from this shop, and she asked me to ask you what the receipt is for. But if you're really busy, or you'd rather not, or it's against the rules, no problem. What's the number? <laughs> uh, 21 dash 3872. 21 dash 3872. Here we go. That ticket was for a large box of assorted unknown items I bought from Henry Bolay. And, uh, that's all I can tell you. Assorted? Is something wrong? Look, I just don't want to make trouble for anyone, okay? Where's the box now? It's still in the back room. I haven't had a chance to really go through it yet. Hey, is there something else I can help you with? Beads, hula dolls, old books. Got great deals on all of them. 
Is Henry Pillay a friend of yours? No, I met him at the reception at Bruno's house following the funeral. Gave Henry my card, said when he wanted to start liquidating, he should give me a call. Did Bruno have a lot of valuable things? Didn't look like it, but what he lacked in quality, he made up for in quantity. That house of his is filled with junk. He kept <laughs> everything. For someone in my business, the place is knick-knack heaven. Hmm. Seeing as this place is called Zeke's, and it's your place, shouldn't your name be Zeke? Guy I bought this place from wouldn't sell it to me unless I swore I wouldn't change the name. So I didn't. Funny thing was, his name wasn't Zeke either. But Guess I'll check this place out some more. Enjoy! Hmm. Need something else? Guess I'll check this place out some more. Enjoy! Okay, so what else can we see here? Uh... That's creepy. Do I have actually a separate inventory? Oh, look, I do as well. Huh. Aw, oh, look at her purse! Aw, oh, that is so cool. I don't know what else I can do here. I don't know if this will do anything. No. Well, I think we'll give uh, Nancy a call. Hello? Good news and bad news, Nance. I found out that the receipt is for a box of stuff that Lamont, that's the guy who owns Zeke's, bought from Henry Bollet. No kidding. What kind of stuff did Henry sell him? That's the bad news. The box is in a back room, and it contains assorted unknown items, and that's all Lamont would tell me. Said something about not wanting to get anyone in trouble. So, looks like that's that. No, no, no. You've got to get into the back room and find <laughs> out what's in that box. No. Which means you're probably going to have to, you know. Oh, no. I'm not going to snoop, Nancy Drew. I told you, I'm a lousy snooper. You've got to, Bess. The place could close by the time I got down there and tried to do it myself. And knowing what's in that box could be really important. Could be? I'm supposed to risk life, limb, and liberty for something that could be important? Yes. I mean, no. I mean, Bess, please. Just find a way to distract this Lamont guy. Look through the box and leave. Hmm. You can do that, okay? You owe me, Nancy Drew. Oh, do you owe me. <laughs> oh, you're the greatest. You really are. <laughs> okay, so how are we going to distract Lamont? That, I don't know. Uh... What do we have here? Oh! What the heck are we doing? What is the point of this? <laughs> okay. Close, but no cigar. What am I doing? Is that supposed to be... What is going on here? Well, I've got the right idea. So how am I supposed to do this? What is over here anyways? Somehow I have to uh, take care of business here. Crying powder? <laughs> Does that help? Giggling powder? <laughs> I like that one. Itching powder? Ooh, they weren't kidding. Secret? Oh, stinking. P U. <laughs> This might come in handy. Okay. Let's go see if that will help us distract our dude here. And she's back! What's up with all those bottles of weird stuff over there? 
Hoodoo is something some of the more superstitious people around here practice. They think if you mix certain herbs and roots a certain way and drink them, or carry special objects around in little mojo bags, it can give you a supernatural edge in your daily life. Does it work? All I can tell you is, the stuff I got in here sells like hotcakes. Somebody thinks it works, so hey, who knows? I think I'll look around some more. Enjoy! Okay, so how do I administer the sneezing powder? Need something else? Hmm. I'm gonna keep browsing if that's okay. You got a question, just holler. So how do I do this? Still here, huh? I'm gonna keep browsing if that's okay. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> okay. Well, we've got ourselves some sneezing powder. And uh, that's cool, and we're in this weird oddity store, Zeke's. But we have run out of time, we're at 20 minutes, so I will take a break. And I will see you next time in Nancy Drew, A Legend of the Crystal Skull.